All right, guys, welcome to a bit of a different video today. Um, yeah, I always get asked, hey, uh, Doc, are you only playing Minecraft or are you sometimes playing other games as well? And yes, indeed, I do. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll take care of it. Uh, for example, Planet Zoo is one of the games that is my little side game when I just want to chill a little bit. You know, I build another little habitat and have some fun. And um, yeah, just load it back in again because, yeah, there is. Okay, here yeah, there was a tiger escaping. What the? Where was that? Oh, here. Why? How did the tiger escape? Oh my god! Another tiger escaped. What's happening with my tiger in habitat all of a sudden? It was safe for the longest time. So anyways, guys, um, yeah, Planet Zoo is one of the games I play for funs on the site. And um, yeah, now there was a new update for the game, the South America pack, which is actually pretty cool. Five new animals. Um, yeah, there is the jaguar, the llama, a new monkey type, capuchin monkey, <laughs> monkey, and the giant ant eater, and also some frogs, um, red-eyed frogs, for some of the special habitats you can have. And yeah, I'm just waiting for daytime to come around here a little bit so you can see a little bit more of the zoo. And yeah, I've been playing this game for a while. As you can see, I have quite a bunch of money in a, quite a few franchises and zoos, and that is one of them. And yeah, the guys of Frontier approached me and said, Hey Doc, you want to show off the new pack? We know you play the game and yeah, we would sponsor the video. So yeah, this is actually the very first real sponsored video I do. So Frontier, thank you so much. Um, and I hope you guys enjoy too. There's a link in the video description, of course, if you want to check out the DLC for the game. Or yeah, in case you have the game already, I can only recommend it. You know, I'm um, having a lot of fun with it and I'm playing it um, quite a bit. All right. Calling keeper, vets and everything to the Lemur habitat. They're freaking out again. Man, you know, those monkeys, they constantly give me trouble. <laughs> Okay, so now let's try to set up a jaguar enclosure here, right? So barriers, ooh, what do we get? What do we get? What do we do for the jaguar? Mm. I think we put an electric fence there. It's not cli climbable. I mean, you can also use natural barriers for them, you know. But for now we go with that. And I like to go with straight grid pieces. Um, that always helps. Um, you know, you want to have a little bit of space in these round nooks and crannies for information, tablets and, and trash cans and all the good stuff people want and need if they come to the zoo. Okay, we want to we wanna give those jaguars some space. Let's go up to here and now we transition into something different. Um, climbable, we need something not climbable. Mm, but stable. Ah, oh, we can also go. We can further go with the electric here, actually. It's alright. Better be safe than sorry. Maybe it's too low, we will see. Maybe the Jaguars will jump over. We'll find out. That's the fun part, finding the ideal living conditions for the animals then, and so on. Okay, so somewhat here in the middle we will have our staff facilities for them. So let's put a little gate in there. Okay, and then we also need some passes, staff passes, obviously not that wide, whoops, no that is length, length is alright, we want to have some, although, let's make a steep turn here, alright, uh, obstructed, a little bit over, okay, like this, okay, we need to connect that to our normal walkways, oops, no, no, no. Put that back in. Okay. And now, um, obviously, we need facilities, right? I mean, there needs to be power and water for, you know, if you want to have an electric fence. Yeah, that's, it's not themed. Let's go wind turbine style. And then we also tell our maintenance crew that they should check that every month. I have enough maintenance people to to run it uh, here, maintenance, every month to make sure it always runs. Cool, cool. Okay, that's taken care of. We can hide that later and make it look a little bit nicer. And now we go into terraforming and let's say around here, we make a little hill. All right, 
Look at that. Now we have a fully working cave back here. Extended it a little bit and now they accepted it. And yeah, we're setting up some trees and some cover it, cover for them. Do they like the moss actually? Let's check it out. Let's moss out the area here a little bit. Um, oh, they don't like these these trees. Okay. Yeah, we need to find a, a nice, nice tree species they like. What about the ash tree? Yeah, they didn't complain about that. Okay. We gave him a little bit to climb here. Okay, okay. They like the plants, but the coverage is not good enough. Okay, what else do we have? Some South American trees. Maybe we can throw a few of that oh, holly tree. Oh, okay. Nice, nice. I like, I like. Put that here. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's a little bit lower. And what is that? Smaller holly tree variant? Oh, nice. Okay. And jaguars. They need to, yeah, we need a little bit more coverage, so um, they are happy. What is that? Oh, okay. A little bit of foliage like that. You know, what I always do first is I try to make the animals happy. And then over time, I, make, uh, I try to make the places look a little bit nicer and so on. But first off, uh, animals need to be happy. Now... Uh, we need enrichment items for them too. Okay, um, so let's give him some. Mm, I always like the frozen blood pumpkin. And it's nice to have those attractions here. Ah, yeah, okay. Okay. You know, so people can actually watch it. Oh, let's give them a piñata zebra. Do they like that? Okay. Toy. Let's go for toys. Uh, enrichment items. Toys. See what they like. Yeah, at the moment this is not the best enrichment for them. We need to. We might have to do some more research and find out better items for them. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Let's see if they are happy with that. Yeah. I mean, uh, some basic play items for them. And, um, yeah, now those animals should actually be pretty happy. Nice. Okay. So now we can also do research in the meantime. How is our research going? I want to see some more building bits and pieces. Ooh, here we go. Research complete. 390 in items. Whoa. Okay. Here we go. That is the South American items. And we keep on researching here. Oh yeah, blueprints. That's always nice. Okay, let's look at the building items a little bit. Oh man, okay, here we go. And theme, South America. Ooh, okay, there is a lot. Ooh, I like the bamboo stuff already. Me likey, me likey. Bamboo walls, yes. Rolls, coils, different colored huts. Oh wow, cool signs. Ooh, cool jaguar sign. Oh man, let's see. Oh look at that, that is cool. <laughs> okay, we need some food here. We need we need some food for people and then we need to build a cool... Oh man, it's a food stand. Oh man, yeah, this is nice. Oh there's the, the little monkeys, the new ones. Ooh, and all kinds of different rocks and things. What what do we have centerpiece-wise? Oh, some nice stone heads. Ooh, I like those. <laughs> nice. Oh, man, you know, it's it's a game of infinite possibilities. That's why I kind of like it. Oh, look, um, like Minecraft, you know, you, there, it's, it has a lot of room for creativity. And you can just play around and, and build all kinds of things. The building system of it is pretty deep as well. How does the other hat look? Oh, cool. Let's put them here. Oh, nice. Let's check out the Jaguar. Beautiful. They're happy now. Now maybe we can get a little baby Jaguar sooner or later. I mean, their habitat is a little bit barren at the moment. But we'll figure it out. Hey, first people are showing up. Nice. Okay, then probably we should give him some food stuff. Um, 
So themes, uh, South America, let's wait uh, for everything. What is that? South American staff room. Oh, I like that. Let's check it out, how it, l how it looks. Oh, wow, very colorful. But let's put this South American themed staff room here. It's always good. What is this? It's always the monkeys. What is your problem, monkeys? <laughs> the monkeys always give me troubles, man. Man, it's gonna take a while until all the habitats look as nice as, as all the ones here and the tree and stuff. Some of the stuff I got, this tree I downloaded from the, um, you know, Steam Workshop. There's many, many cool bits and pieces there. Oh, check this out. Nice. Hey, yeah. Very colorful. This is staff room inside. Cool. I like it. I like it. Okay. We should also have a look at all the other animals, man. We can briefly drop them in here. <laughs> to maybe see see how they look. But first of all, um, yeah, I want to wait uh, for some, some more research to be done. Um, and then we can look at more theme items of the new pack. That would be really interesting. And then we also check out all the new animals. I want to at least have a look at it. Hey, jaguar poop. Fascinating. Alright, that was quick. I unlocked a few more building bits and pieces here, you know, pre-made stuff. That is cool. Come on. Yeah, trash cans. Trash cans is key, guys. Oh, I was just thinking that uh, Jaguar escaped here, but it's just my statue. Okay, let's put... You know, you need trash cans. Trash cans is the, <laughs> the, 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 the holy grail in this game. If you don't have enough trash cans... Oh, what? You have an injured animal? Ooh, is somebody fighting? It must be the monkeys again. Okay, we got trash cans all over the place. South... Uh, oh, man, the benches. Let's look at them. Oh, I like him so much. You can sit here, chill with your back, back to the jaguars. You know, jaguar can sneak up to you. Beautiful. Put a few benches down. What else do we have? Picnic canopies. Oh... Oh, there's so many nice bits and pieces in here. Let's give him some some, some shelter here from the sun. Nice. Ah, uh, okay. I'm gonna have a lot of fun with this, man. Now we just want to check out some of the stuff, man. You can you can get lost in detail here. Uh, this game is, you know, it. Ah, oh, the picnic tables. Look at them. Also with the jaguar face on there. Love that. Okay, we need food. Guest facilities. Let's stop here real quick. Let's give people some food. What do we have? Is there South... Yeah, maybe we also have some South American food, actually. Wait. Zoo. Oh, we got more research. Oh, we'll find out now. We'll find out soon. Okay. Did that unlock some food, food stalls, maybe, for um, South American team? No. All. Okay, those are just the shells. All right. Yep. So as American workshop, the surgery, a trade center, toilets. Ooh, nice. Oh, look at that with the with the butterflies. That's so neat. Okay, put them here. Some toilets. Always need them. Nice. What else do we have? No, we don't need large. Staff room. Ah, oh, shop. It's just a shell, right? Yeah. Large shop. Ooh, look at that. Nice. Oops. With the gates. It's like a gate shape. Oh, I like this so much. That's a nice style. Okay, let's put it roughly here. And now we need we need some actual shops in there. So, what do we have? Yeah, let's put some milkshakes in the place. Do, 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 do. Milkshakes, milkshakes, milkshakes. Alright. Wait, let's zoom in a little bit. Hey, where you at? Come here. Good milkshakes and something to eat. 
Monsignor Fried. Uh, the good old Monsignor Fried. Can never hurt. Boom. Monsignor Frita. <laughs> um, you also need some some people, uh, Linskis, worker, Linskis here, uh, vendor. And dos venderos. Boom. You work there. Sell stuff. Well, we have. Oh wait, we have excess vendors. So. But if I get new shops, I always get new vendor vendors in the in the house. Okay, man, this is cool. Let's look at look at the theming here. Oh yeah, people already buying. Cheetah is expecting offspring. Okay, how oh, is 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 somebody pregnant here? By the way. Okay, I'm just running the game fast at the moment, so we get the research done quick. Okay, we're learning some stuff. Okay, let's see. Mechanic research, how far in are we? Yeah, we're getting there. The last blueprints. Okay, and for habit, for the habitat here? Let's quickly check. Um, habitat, Jaguar. Do, did we unlock any new special toys for them? A block of ice. No, that's not special, but... Let's give it to them. You know, we want to make our cheat our little guys happy there, our jaguars. Oh yeah, okay. Let's have a quick peek. What are the animals doing in here? Slow down. Anybody pregnant or so? How are we doing? Ah, oh, majestic. Oh yeah, offspring. Yeah, I've played 59 years, so... <laughs> Uh, in November we're gonna have we're gonna have jaguar babies. Oh man! Okay, but I wanna quickly I wanna see the other animals um, real quick. That's for sure. Okay, you know what? We're gonna wait until November to get some jaguar offspring, and we also wanna have a look at the other animals. So I'm gonna set up a temporary pen over here. Uh, we put them in and at least can check them out. Oh, offspring imminent! A little baby jaguar. Please, yes. I love cats. Big cats, small cats, and especially baby cats. Oh man, this guy was climbing. Yeah, the climbing is also awesome in this game. They can climb. Oh. Oh. Oh, that's not a baby. And it's, that's not a baby. <laughs> or is it? No, no, this is not how baby jaguars look. Guys, no, no, no. <laughs> Oh man, the monkeys are, are going wild over there still. You know, there are way too many. I need to put them all on birth control and because there are so many. And then they're constantly territorial, fight and eat each other's food all the time. It's, you know, another proof that humans, you know, obviously derive from <laughs> monkeys or apes. Well, here I got some llamas now. I mean, what is it with all the animals pooping all the time? That's beautiful. Yes, I know. It's the monkeys. Oh. Do they spit? I wonder. <laughs> Probably if some new, uh, people get too close. Baby jaguar? Baby jaguar? <gasps> Baby jaguar! Twins! Ooh, look at that! There it is! You beautiful thing. Oop. Push in the face. No. Stay here. Oh, I love him. Let's, let's track him with the camera. Jaguar. Baby Jaguar. Oh, Man. Ferocious little thing. Perfect. And while we wait for the, for the giant anties to be delivered, let's look for the... Uh, for them monkeys, right? Um, reset them filters. Um, okay. We wanna look uh, monkeys, monkeys, monkeys here. Uh, here, Colombian white face capucin monkeys. Ooh, yeah, give me all of that. Why llama? <laughs> no, no, not llamas. Give me the monkeys. Monkeys. 
Ah, here we go. Let's buy one. One is enough. I don't want to have more monkeys. Let's move him in here right away. Alright. Yep. Lama is drinking a bit. So that's fine. Yes, yes, I know the monkeys are going wild. Okay. So, let's speed things up a little bit so we see the delivery. Oh! Who gave baby? No, animal died. Oh, 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 oh! New animals! Yeah, it's the monkeys. Oh, the giant ant eater. There it is! Two of them! Two headed beast! <laughs> oh, they're running! What's your problem? Are they fighting? They're pretty happy. I mean, yeah, we obviously would have to adjust their habitat a little bit. Oh, look at them! Wait. They're speeding at each other! And fighting! Why? Be friendly! And they bite! Uh, yo, don't, you don't want the ant eaters to get into the mix. Okay, let's put a monkey in here. A monkey will calm them down. Yes, please. Oh, Yes. If you know Pippi Longstocking, that's the monkey she had. Capuc Capucina monkey. Oh, Wait, what? Everybody's fighting in here. Nobody likes it. Oh man, you can look at them claws. I mean, you know, you don't want to... Those ant eaters, they can claw you up, man. But hey, this is all the new animals. Okay, there's the frogs too. Right, you can also have like a small habitats and have like all kinds of insects and amphibia and uh, you know. And um, yeah, the frog is part of that. Um, you can definitely wait. Let's check it out. Animal trading, how the frog looks. Right, so you here you have all the small animals you can have. Ooh, yeah. Man, there's so many. Yeah, I need to start uh, setting up some some exhibits for those guys, man. Oh, golden poison frogs. Man, I love animals. Man. Goliath frogs. <laughs> mm -hmm. Let's look. Oh, here. Red eye. That is the new... Oh, man, they're so cute. Oh, man, I want to have them too. <laughs> Ah, all the new animals are great, they added, for sure. And who doesn't want to have llamas? Llamas are the best, they're the coolest guys. Right, look at them. Majestic. <laughs> hey, stop spitting. <laughs> Some anteaters and then the king of the jungle, the jaguar. Uh, chilling in their cave? Yeah, they are. Hello. Oop. Man, you know, those animal uh, keepers, they are fearless. Anyways, guys, I think we wrap it up for today. That was a brief overview of what is new in the game now with all the South American DLC. Oh man, these monkeys. <laughs> yeah, I need to take care of that habitat. Whoa, look at that. Oh, this is so cool. Monkey habitat is a dirt risk now. The monkeys are taking over the zoo, man. I need to really do something. <laughs> okay, guys. Thank you so much for watching. And uh, thank you, uh, Frontier Games, again, um, for hooking me up with the game. And also even, yeah, making a sponsored video out of that. Really, really cool. One of my favorite games aside of Minecraft. You know, some Planet Zoo action. And yeah, I'll turn this into a nicer habitat for them for sure. But, uh, you know, it'll take some time. Bye-bye! Whee!